During Passover, many people came to Jerusalem to worship at the temple. They would bring animals with them to sacrifice to God. They did this to ask forgiveness for their sins. Some of the temple officials were dishonest and greedy and saw a great business opportunity. They decided to start selling animals and many other things so they could make a lot of money. The temple became more like a flea market than a house of God. Jesus also celebrated the Passover and went to the temple with his disciples. When he saw how people were turning God's house into a marketplace, he became very angry and sad. The temple was supposed to be a place where God was worshipped, a place where people could pray to God. Instead, these people made a mockery of it. Jesus, filled with righteous anger, decided to put an end to it. He made himself a short whip, perfect for driving stubborn animals, and went inside to clear out all the animals and shopkeepers. Once inside, he grabbed tables and flipped them over. He kicked over benches and tossed aside stools. He freed the doves and set the goats and sheep free. The money changers and merchants were outraged. What in the world are you doing? Who gave you the right to do this? They shouted in anger. Get out, Jesus shouted. Don't turn my father's house into a den of thieves, he said. Some of the merchants were furious at Jesus and could not wait to get rid of him. Jesus knew that they had wicked hearts and that they did not serve God. He wanted to teach them a lesson. When the people saw this, they were very surprised. Who is this Jesus? With what authority does he do these things, they said. So many of the lame and sick people came to Jesus and he healed them. When the priests and scribes saw this, they were jealous and mad. Jesus was not afraid of them. He continued to do God's work, telling people about God's love and doing many miracles.